act to flirt. Undertale Dating Simulator. It's been requested a few times. And at first, I wasn't sure because it said demo. So, you know, I was like, oh, maybe I should just wait for the full thing to come out. But a lot of people seem to want me to play it. So I was like, you know what? All right, let's just play it. All right, let's get this party started, I guess. Oh, look at it, it's spooky. Quite some time since I've seen someone else try to alter this world. Girl, you got asthma. Talk faster. <laughs> okay, come on. You exude something different. Oh, I'm built different. Oh, were we romancing? Oh, I got a few ideas. Different than others who have been here. Oh, 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 that goes hard. Oh. Oh, oh my god, I'm, I'm dancing? Ah, uh, yes, I see it now. You already know this world. Oh! Are they like saying that I already know the world of Undertale? You've existed outside of it for quite some time. What the hell? Wait, what? Haven't you? Wait! Oh, this is intimidating, actually! Haha. <laughs> Oh my god! Stop! No! I hate it when you pretend they can see me! That's so scary! I wish you were you are. How about your passion? Oh, I got a lot of passion. I, I can show you my passion. Okay. I give you a temporary reward just for you. Oh! Okay, thank you! I do! I do! I do! My, 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 my preteen self is screaming! And how beautiful it is to be really Oh! Who is this talking? Quiet, my bad. Oh, and one more thing. A word of advice. There's much more to this world than meets the eye. Now, go on. Oh my god. Now, go on. Okay, so I was doing another soundtrack. An Undertale fan game by Zerkun. Okay, Zerkun. Zerkun or Zerkun? Time to save it for debugging. That's fine. Okay, click space, enter, continue, arrow keys, navigate UI. Uh, confirm you. Yeah, let's begin! <gasps> Name that flirtatious fallen human! Y'all already know! Y'all already know! Is, it, is Hor correct? Wait, no, no, no. I, I want to make I want to make the W lowercase. <laughs> Is Hor correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's perfect. Oh, Gaster! It's Gaster! I'm calling it right now. That was Gaster. Oh, oh my little oh, my little heart. Oh, it jumped. Oh, hello, Howie. I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Golly, the underground just seem to be filled with humans lately. So a relationship only works through mutual communication. You guys have to tell me when things are wrong, like when I'm quiet. Other, okay, other than that, let's continue playing. Golly, the underground just seems to be filled with humans lately. Because they heard Sans and- No, they heard Toriel was here in Metaton. 
But you are still new here, so I ought to give you some pointers. Okay. Something's wrong. That look on your face. You know what's going on, don't you? Oh! <laughs> okay. All about love and EXP. <laughs> well, if that's the case, then I don't need to teach you anything. Oh, this whore. Okay. Oh. Huh? What's going on? FP? LP? I haven't seen those terms before. Hey, you. Did you do this? Do you know what these mean? <laughs> it was me. It was me. Oh! Oh, well, you're just a little baby. You're not scary. You're literally just a baby flower. I could put you in a little pot and I'll throw you in the ocean. I know you, but I'm not vibing with getting pegged by a flower, so you'd better not be an option. I'm pretty sure he's like a kid. We are not going to peg the flower. Or, I mean, we're not going to get pegged by the flower. There will be no pegging or flowers involved. You. What did you do? The world is much brighter somehow. Like, oh, he, he doesn't like that I, I don't know, got, gave him some antidepressants. I hate it. <laughs> I'm going to change you back, even if I have to kill you to do it. something. Alright, we're gonna act because we have to... We... Can we only flirt? I mean, it is called act to flirt, so... You flirted with Cloud. He seems puzzled by your actions. I'm sorry? Are you seriously trying to flirt with me right now? What kind of fool do you take me for? I'm not going to accept some random human gesture of affection. Oh. Looks like somebody's been hurt in their past, okay. But, as it seemed, Flowey was actually truly interested on the inside. Flowey gained 10 love points! That's what LP is! It's love points! Love points? That's what LP stands for! Yes, and FP stands for friendship points, if you were wondering. I wasn't, but thanks anyway, narrator that won't stop talking! Flowey seems to <laughs> He does not seem ready to attack. He seems like everybody's profile picture in 2015. Okay, act. Okay, what if we flirt again? You flirted with Flowey again. He seems aggravated. Again with this? You don't get it, do you? It's kill or be killed. I'm trying to kill you. So stop flirting with me. It seems Flowey is probably lying to you. I am not. Flowey seems ready to attack. Oh, I don't. I don't have any. Yeah, okay, I think. A nearby seed on the ground. Pick it up. Yeah, sure. You obtain the seed. Flowey is confused by your actions. Wait, but my bullets are supposed to hurt you? This is just infuriating. Not to mention confusing. Turn the seed? Yeah! You give back Flowey his bullet. You claim it to be an offer of friendship. He's gonna be so pissed. An offer of friendship? What, do you think these are some kind of friendliness pellets or something? They are! They're friendliness pellets! Let's go! Get lost. Ah! Uh, ah! Look at you! Ah! You liked it! But as it seems, actually appreciated the gesture. You've got to be kidding me. Flowey seems off foot. When can I spare you? Item? Okay, yeah, I don't have any items. Act. I'm gonna flirt again. You flirt with Flowey again. No! This is enough! You keep flirting with me even though I'm trying to kill you? I don't know whether I should be flattered or concerned. 
Well, I gained 10 LP. Mercy. Spare? You spared Flowey. Flowey seems off. Okay. Okay, confession time. I've never played the, like, actual Undertale. <laughs> I've never played it! I've never played it! But, but, no, 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 no. I, I did watch, like, eight different YouTubers play it. So, I, I pretty much played it. I, I got it all through osmosis. Again. I don't know that, okay. Talk. Oh! I forgot you could just talk to him! Nice day we're having. I thought, I thought today was beautiful, Flowey. Do you think I care? Because I don't, oh shit, okay. Stop being such an annoying nuisance. Stop it. Sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's... Uh, um... <laughs> Forget it. Ugh, I am so sick of seeing that bar go up. I'm leaving. Later, idiot. Oh, okay. I, I guess he ran away. Flo yeah, Flower ran away. We got him, boys! We did it! We did it! We got him, boys! That awful creature, once again torturing a defenseless person. Oh! Oh! Lord have mercy, we must stay focused! I hope you aren't harmed. I apologize that I could not have been here for you sooner. Very literally, check the entrance to the rooms at this hour to see if any humans has fallen down. Although, it hasn't been quite too long since someone has actually appeared. Do forgive my rudeness. I don't even introduce myself yet. My name is Tori. I'm the caretaker of these ruins. I shall lead you to safety. Okay, let's go! Ooh! Love the little airbrush art. I must apologize, but it is not only dangerous ahead for you to continue, but also a bit of a mess. <laughs> oh, that's fine. I hope you do not mind, but I will have to ask you to wait here for the time being while I tidy up. It will only take a few moments. Oh my, I shouldn't leave you here all alone. Please, take this home. I apologize for having to leave you here, but do call me if you need help. God help me if it's T-Mobile. You obtained a cell phone. With it, you can make calls and receive text messages. Ooh, gonna text my shoddy bay Sands. Hello. I'll be return to Oh! Sell. Okay, okay, let's go. I can, I can, I, I can, I can call a little sneaky links. Okay. What's up? Oh! Confession time part two. <laughs> Confession time part two. When I was younger, I, I I very much had a crush on Napster Blue. I thought he was so cute. I, I the, the, his his music taste is good. Just putting that out there, his music taste is very good. You probably should go sitting amongst the leaves. I'm new in town. You want to show me around? You tell the ghost that you're new in town. Really? I'm not coming around here either. I just come here to be alone. I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk about myself so much. No! No! Don't leave! No! You tell the ghost they don't have to leave and that you weren't bothered by their talking. Flattered, you ask. They gave it to FD. Oh, that's so cute! That's 
what seems more cheery. Oh my god! It's a nice day, isn't it? It's a beautiful day! Now that you're in it! Woo! You tell them you think today is a beautiful day. Oh, I guess you're right. Have some look, enjoy the conversation, they gave what a fee! Let's go! Okay. Cheer. You tell them absolutely that they're going to do great things in life. Gained the five FP. Oh my god, look at me! Flirt. You flirted with Naps to look. I don't think you can do No! No, baby! I can give you everything you've ever wanted, please! No! No! Oh, hobbies? Yeah, I totally forgot to ask about your hobbies. What are your hobbies? Oh, oh, oh! Ow! I just punched my desk! Ow! You ask what kind of hobbies they have. Hobbies? I guess. I like music. I've written some before. I don't think you'd be interested. Naps look as flattered you ask. They gave 2 FP. Well, I'm on fire. Naps look seems more cheery. Act. Oh, listen, 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 listen. You offer to listen to a nap track Naps look has made. Oh, I'm so good at this game! I'm so good at this game! What was the place of this? I've never had anyone ask that before. Napsalook is happy you offered to listen to their music. You, they gained 5 FP. Oh! Oh! It's so good! This is what I was talking about earlier! Oh my god, this one. I would listen to this on loop for an hour if I had the option. It's that good. It's so good. You tell Naps to look, their music is amazing. Yeah, your music is amazing! Oh, gee. Thanks. Naps to look is floored. They get 10 FP! Act. Flirt. Again? Is that gonna... Oh, it's the same thing. Okay. Maybe if you tried something else first, they'd have a different reaction. What? Okay. Wait. Items? Okay. Wait, what does wait mean? Talk? Okay. Return. What does wait mean? I have to wait to see if Napsuk would say anything. Oh! I didn't realize that's what that meant. <gasps> what? What just happened? You do everything in your power to bring a grin to Napsalook's face. You lose 10 swoon points. Oh, thanks. I feel a bit better. That was weird, okay. Talk. Act. Okay. Oh, do we- Oh, we can do stuff over again! Okay. <gasps> Let's listen to another. Wow. No one's ever left their music as much as this. That's look is amazed. They gained 7 FP. This one is just as good! Oh, it's just as good! Do you like it? Oh my god, yes! Oh, it's poor the 10 FP! <gasps> it seems Napsable has taken a liking to you! Flirt! You flirted with Napsable. It seemed a bit sheepish to respond. Oh, that's so cute! Oh, I've never had someone flirt with me like that before. I've never really felt like this before either. That's what this been. Oh my god, my, my vocabulary is gone. That's what this been fantasizing. They gave 10 LP! That's what seems to be dreaming. Marry me! Marry me! 
Check for a nearby. Ooh! There are no items around. Aw. Okay, we're flirting again. You flirted with Naps with you. It seemed a bit. Okay, is it the same thing? Okay. <gasps> oh, I just did it again! Okay. Too many people anymore. Um, I don't want to sound pushy, but I want to give this to you. Naps look hands you a snail. It has a golden stripe down its shell. You think that goes for the striped snail? It was added to your items. I will get out of here right now. No, you don't have to. Oh my god. Oh, you are so wonderful. Oh, you're pretending to sleep now? Aw, oh, that's fine. I won't bother you. What happens if I call Toriel? What's up, Toriel? What's up? Oh, it's you. Has something happened? I just wanted to hear your voice. Oh my. Don't be so silly now. I'm not being silly! I'm being silly in love! I want you! You have nothing to do. I promise I won't take much longer. Okay, bye. Let's leave. I'm out of this piece. You were seeing Toriel leave out of that door earlier. Follow the exit. Why not? Let's go. I decide to climb up the stairs and walk to the exit. Shawty trying to hide my baby, but Plan B is the only plan. It's very dark. Probably because of all the torches are out. Oh. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like there's any way to light them. Continue? <laughs> no, it's scary. Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna continue. You continue, despite not being able to see where you're going. <sighs> this is so ominous. Hello? You hear a sound, but don't know what it is. Continue. I back down to nothing. Even still, you continue down the dark hall. <laughs> I'm not begging. I don't die. That would suck so bad. Hola. Oh lord. Oh lordy. Oh lordy lord. Oh goodness. Oh 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 God in the sky. Oh Padre un cielo. Mm. Oh no. What is? <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Oh, you found the dog. It seems happy to see you. It's like chasing you back to the room you came from. Ah! The dog ran back through the doorway. But before it left, it dropped a large yellow flower on the ground at your feet. It obtained yellow flower. It was added to your items. <laughs> that was so... Oh, my heart. I almost went into cardiac arrest. But I didn't. Anyway. Oh, good. You are still here. I apologize. That took much longer than I thought. But now the way should be safe and cleared. Come now. I'll lead you to your new home. Okay, let's go. Lead the way. You're gonna want the snail I have, aren't you? Like, that's what I'm gonna get past you, isn't it? Ooh! This song, this song will always be comforting. Always! I'll bark back. I hope you are able to get comfortable. Welcome to your new home. I even set up a room for you down the hall to the right. Is something burning? Please, excuse me a minute. Okay. Oh! Ooh, okay. I took the shelf near the stairs. There seems to be a plethora of books on it. Will you read any? The Best Jokes of 20XX. You opened a book called The Best Jokes of 20XX. Did you hear about the restaurant on the moon? Great food, no atmosphere. <laughs> That's funny because the, the moon doesn't actually have an atmosphere. Yeah, yeah, anyway. What do sprinters eat before a race? Nothing. They, 
They fast. Why don't crabs give to charity? They're shellfish. Okay. The book goes on with jokes like this for over 50 pages. Um, I'm, I'll do that one last. Oh. Take a step towards the stairs. Well, it's only a slight creak from the first step. Um, I'm sorry, did you refrain from going downstairs? Thank you. Oh. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. Okay. Let's check out our room. <gasps> it's so warm and cute! I love the way they designed the, like, interactables. That's very nice. Can I save? The mayor plushie on the floor seems untouched and dusty. But even so, you can't help but find it cute. You're filled with passion. Power points and spoon points restored. <gasps> yes, let's say. Ooh! I see you! Alright, save. Alright, let's return. There is a crayon drawing of a flower on the wall. Somehow, it feels familiar, despite knowing for a fact you've never seen it before. Okay. Oh! 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 That's so clever! I didn't know what was going on! Okay, let's go to bed. The bed looks awfully comfortable. However, you can't shake the feeling that you haven't really explored your whole environment yet. Rest anyway? No. We'll go explore the rest. I'm a good egg. Oh! You inspect the bookshelf in the corner of the room. Will you read any books? Secondary school level algebra. Ew, I'd literally rather kill something. 72 uses for snails or the history of humans and monsters. That sounds interesting. You open a book called The History of Humans and Monsters. Humans and monsters used to rule over the earth in peace. But after humanity waged war against the monsters, Earth was never the same. Monsters were sealed underground with a barrier. Only those with strong souls, such as humans, could enter or exit. Human souls differ greatly from monster souls. They are stronger and driven by ideals. I don't think they ever explained this. <gasps> Bravery, justice, integrity, kindness, perseverance, patience, passion! You're not sneaky. I know that says passion. That's right. I know I know basic words. Determination. There seems to be some scratched out parts in the book after this part. Okay. The fire in the fireplace is warm, but the wood doesn't seem to be burning. Very curious if it's because the fire magic isn't burn the wood, or if it's just because it would be too tedious to go to burning fireplace. Probably the former. There sits a perfectly toriel sized chair on the opposite side of the room. I wonder if it has some kind of name like Cheriel. No, of course not. That would be silly. Okay. That is... Okay. That is... Mm. I'm... I'm not a critic. Okay. The table centerpiece is strangely just a bunch of sticks and a flower vase. I wonder if the vase ever held anything else at some point. It just fucking sticks. Alright, kitchen. You can hear Toriel working furiously in the kitchen. Yeah, she's angry. She... She's angry. She's mad. Maybe now isn't a good time to bother her. Okay, good night, y'all. I'm going back to my room. I'm going buddy bye. Off the light in the bed. You're getting a bit tired. It won't be so bad if you just take a little rest. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Who are you? Hi, Torio! Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to wait. I only meant to leave you a slice of pie. Well, um, now that you're awake, would you like to eat out in the family room instead? You decided that you'd rather get up than go back to sleep. Yeah, let's eat with Torio! Here you are, a nice warm slice of cinnamon butterscotch pie. I wonder if it tastes good. Hopefully it's not too hot. Or too burnt. <laughs> you take a bite out of the cinnamon butterscotch pie. It's flavorful, delighting your taste buds with sweetness. Ah, uh, do you like it? <gasps> I would say you look delighted at the very least. 
Victoria seems to be waiting for your response. Ah! I know what's going on. 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 I'm so smart. That pie, magnifique. Bro, my, I've been to it, my toes curled. You can tell Torio that her pie is the greatest you've ever had. Oh my, you really think so? You need to be so kind. It's burnt after all. I, I don't care, I like them burnt. Torio's baffled and bashful. She gained 7 FP. Oh, I can do this. She's enjoying watching you eat. Okay, okay, a little bit of a freak. Okay. Gaze, we're gonna gaze at her. Oh, longingly, okay! You gaze at Toriel longingly. Is there something you want to say to me? Goodness, you're going to make me blush if you keep staring at me like that. <gasps> Let's go! Toriel seems to be already blushing. She gained 5 LP. Okay. Nice day! You tell Toriel that you think today is a beautiful day. So, the weather in the rooms is usually pretty consistently dreary. I haven't seen the light of the sun in. How long has it been now? Oh my, it's been quite a long time, but I really can't even remember. Toriel enjoyed the conversation. Ooh, I feel like I made her feel old. My bad, I'm sorry. She gained 3 FP. Alright, we're gonna flirt. We're just gonna do it! Come with a cheesy line and offer it to Toriel. Goodness. How adorable. Oh. But don't you think you can find better than an old lady like me? Toy is only a little bit, is only a bit moved. She gained 3 LP. Insist. Delicious pie! Amazing pie! I was. I was. I was. No. No words, just barking. You insist that Toriel's pie tastes much better than she thinks. My, thank you greatly. If I didn't know any better, I would think you were just trying to save these things to win me over. <gasps> Toriel is overjoyed. She gained 7 FP. Act. I'm gonna flirt again. <gasps> you assure Toriel that her age does not matter to you. Oh! Yeah! You know who can get it? My, are you sure about that? You are quite possibly the most interesting human I've ever met. <gasps> Let's go! 10 LP. Items. You take the striped snail. Yeah, I know. I, I got what you want. I got what you need. You can count on me, baby. I got what you want. That's right. I got this for you. I know you wanted a snail. So I got you a snail. You give Tori the snail that you were given back at the ruins entrance. Oh. Snail, and such a nice one at that. Is it really that obvious that I'm a fan of snails? Regardless, I thank you deeply for this gift. Where did you even find this? Tori was wondering how she'll cook the snail. Oh! I'm sorry, Naps to Blood! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Gaze, gaze again. Okay, yeah. Alright, more, 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 more. This is gonna make her sad, I think. I no, I feel like that was a wrong idea. You asked Toriel how long she's been down here. Long before you were born, I can only assume. It has been quite a long time since any monsters have been able to get to the surface. If they not teach humans about the war that happened so long ago. That is upsetting to you. Toyo feels a bit closer to you. She gained 10 FP! Let's go. Let's go. I'm I'm literally I'm, I'm I I I don't know. I'm literally I'm 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 a god. That's what this is. Send it to wait to see if Toyo would say anything. Should I prepare something to do? Or maybe we're still tired. I apologize. I didn't wake you prematurely. No! No! Okay, that is always a bad option I've learned. Dig up the best snail based fun that you could think of to cheer Toriel. You lose 10 SP. Oh my. I didn't realize you'd heard jokes. You heard that joke as well. It's one of my favorites. How did you know? 
Okay. We're good now. We're good now. Once again, you give one of your best lines tutorial. Your words truly do work so kind of magical. I don't think I felt so high off the ground in here. Yeah, I can make you feel high off the ground. Oh! Tutorial is head over heels. Her LP is maxed out! The time is just slipping away. I've been talking for so long that I didn't even realize how late it had gotten. <gasps> oh, it's my only option! I mean, I was gonna get there eventually. But wow, the game is just forcing me. Okay, okay, Tom Mama, how do I how do I get out of here? You asked Toriel how to leave the ruins. Oh, I'm sorry! I suppose it wouldn't be any good for you to stay trapped out here with me. There isn't much to do anyways. I get bored in no time at all. Come with me. I will show you the exit. Oh! Is it, is it because I, like, romanced her first? Oh, I feel so bad. Toriel, it's not- No, it's just I want to explore. Are we gonna fight? Oh my god, are we about to fight? Because I don't want to fight her. The exit to the ruins. I have long been to destroy this place and lock off connections to the rest of the underground. But it seems that eight times over now, I have been convinced to do otherwise. Or so be never quite as kind as I have been to you. I can only hope that the best will come to you once you leave these ruins. It is not much, but... Toya hands you a hundred gold, as well as another slice of her cinnamon butterscotch pie! Let's go! Oh, is that what I look like? <laughs> okay. I mean... Very much not what I look like in real life, but okay. I wanted to give you something for your journey ahead. Please, stay safe for me. You do call if you ever get the chance. It would be lovely to hear your beautiful voice again. Okay. Toriel walked away. Okay, we walking, we're walking. As you exit the ruins, you find it's just as dark outside as it was inside. It's a lot colder here than it was in the ruins. The snow is even fluttering now. I know who you are, but we're gonna save first. Despite the colder and the dark scenery, you're still excited to see what will come next. You're filled with passion. Heart points and soon points are stored. We're gonna save over this because it's the same game. Can't do anything else, right? Hello! Hello! You approach a low and stand in the middle of the snowy forest clearing. There seems to be someone at the stand. Oh, man. <laughs> they seem to be asleep. Wake up, Sands! Wake up! You tap your finger against the wooden surface of the sand to try and wake them up. Oh! <laughs> Caught me off guard. Oh. Uh, so. I wasn't expecting anyone. Oh. oh I, feel, I feel uneasy. <laughs> the, the, oh, the music. Especially not a human. So. Technically, my job would be to, uh, to take you to the king. But just between you and me, I really don't feel like doing my job right now. And you couldn't tell by the fact that I was sleepy. So, since I really wasn't expecting to do anything, today I'm gonna head back to sleep. Oh! Sans! Wake up! Oh! Oh! Hola, Papyrus! Hello! How many times do I have to tell you not to fall asleep at your post? Sorry, bro. I can help myself. You've really been working me down to the bone lately. Ah! This is not the time for your stupid puns! I need your help in finding another human! Undyne said she has no idea what happened to the lap. So you mean a human? Like, the one right here? OH MY GOD! Okay. He's always like this! Sans, why did 
didn't you tell me you found another human? <laughs> it just showed up while I was sleeping. <laughs> this is fantastic! Now I can actually join the Royal Guard! Ahem! Human! You must come with me! You have been captured by the Great Papyrus! I will take you to Undyne and you are not going to question it! And we will for sure not become friends! Because, um, that is precisely why I haven't gone into the Royal Guard yet! Um, that means you're supposed to follow me! <laughs> Don't worry about my bro, he wouldn't hurt a fly. Or a human. Ah. Hey, you know, my bro knows the best people to keep him waiting. Couldn't he catch up with him? Who else am I go be? Oh. Who are you? Sans. Sans the skeleton. The love of my life. The love of my life. But, hey. You already knew that, didn't you? Woohoo! How did he know? Oh, of course he knew he's Sans, but ah! Oh, the music. Oh. <laughs> Hi. Um, what is this place? Snowden. Not much else to say about it other than that. Just a lot of snow and ice. And Snowden Town. Which is down the road a ways before you even ask me. My mom and I live there. It's pretty okay. I don't want to say what's up with that guy, that's rude. And by that guy, you mean my brother. You want to watch what you say. Anyway, so if you didn't have any more questions, I think I'm gonna nod off. I didn't want to be rude. Why Why would I say that? Can I still call Toriel? Human! So you decided to follow me! Er, not that you had a choice in the matter, of course. But let's just continue forward. Human! I know you are new to the underground, but I have recently redesigned the entire entrance to Snowden. Purely for the inclusion of my new puzzles. Oh, lord. Yeah! Of course, these are still new and untested. So you will test them. Yeah! See that signpost? That is the first puzzle. Yeah! Good luck! But if you need help, I'll give you a hint or two. <laughs> Thank you, Papyrus. Thank you. Why is he stance? Okay, baddie. Okay, baddie, look at you. You are standing like a queen. Look at you. Okay. Oh, it's a puzzle. Um, Lord, okay. Wait, no. Okay, um. Oh my god. How am I? Okay. Oh, it's a slide one. Oh my god, I'm so bad at slide ones. Oh, let's go. Oh, let's go. Oh, why am I getting so confused? It's just a simple puzzle! Is this two separate puzzles? Oh! You click on it to- Oh! Oh my god, I'm an idiot! I got it though. Oh my god, why would my idiot brain? Okay. Oh, you completed the first puzzle. Amazing, isn't it? I drew it myself. I love it. I, I love it. I took inspiration from the many historical human animations there are. Anime, I think they were called. It's very anime, compilers. <laughs> Being a human yourself, I'm sure you already know what I'm talking about. Though they are quite ridiculous to me. Since it is a major part of human culture, no human could resist such a doing such a puzzle. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe that was a bit too easy. But I haven't been defeated yet. The Great Papyrus has many more puzzles to come. 
That was a lot, bro. The signpost has directions to different parts of the snowy forest. North ice, south ice, west ice, east Snowden town. Well, I guess I know which way we're going. There you are, human! I definitely didn't think I lost you for a minute there. Why would you say that? You, you didn't? Yes, of course you didn't! <laughs> Never mind that! We have puzzles to do! Or rather, you do, and I'm going to sit and watch you complete them! Now, for this puzzle, direct your attention above you! Yeah! I decorated the ceiling of Snowden purely for this puzzle. There's four symbols you can see at the center. Ish, right? Count how many there are of each. Then, when you think you know how many there are, tell me. But they might not be so easy to spot. I pin them around in the ice. <laughs> Good luck, human. How many of this? Press H to view the whole image in return. Oh, Lord Squiggle Teeth Triangle Rhombus. One, two. Two. You're correct! I made that symbol based off of the Royal Guard. Since that's the symbol they all wear on their armor, and once I turn into the Kingdom, I'll also be able to wear it. Yeah! I'm so excited! How many of these? Weird question mark Phineas the Furb looking. Okay, one, two, three, four. Wait. One, two, three, four. There's four. You're correct! It's an uncanny resemblance of my face, is it not? Oh, that's what it is. Yeah. Ah, it looks like you. Once I become popular in the Royal Guard, King Asgore will have pushes shaped to my likeness as well. No matter where you are in the underground, the Great Papyrus will be there. How many of this? Okay, weird band-aid circle sharp thing weird bandage circle sharp one two three it's only three you're correct it should be obvious who this design is should it now should it be obvious he's only the most popular monster in the entire underground medicine I suppose he doesn't look quite like this anymore. I think that's a Metaton. How many of this? Oh, uh, um, top of Bongo Cat's head, but uh, they got an awful car accident. That's what that is. That that's what that is. One, two, three, four, five. That's it. You're correct. What better mark to leave than one modeled after a bone? instead. Oh, you got them all correct! Hm. Maybe I should add more. Your counting adds more difficulty. You are very good at puzzles, human. But I have not yet been defeated. <laughs> let's continue. Alright, let's go then. Road trip. There seems to be a paper attached to the sign. The paper is folded up, but can be pulled down. This is the sign of learning. Is there something you've come across that you still don't understand? What is waiting? It may seem useless, but waiting can be useful depending on the type of date you are on. Not everyone likes to be with someone who talks or flirts with them all the time. Though, at the same time, some people may start to feel uncomfortable if you stay silent too long. Sometimes, your date may appreciate if you do absolutely nothing at all. Be sure to know the person you're on a date with so you don't break their heart. <gasps> oh, okay, that makes sense. What is heartbreak and LV? Tell me. No, I don't get heartbreak. Whether you've seen a monster's soul crack or not at this point, they're fragile. You should be careful when playing with emotions. If you manage to crack a monster's soul three times, they will no longer be interested in dating you and the date will end. This will not result in the game over. Instead, you'll just have to live with the fact that you broke someone's heart with love as a reminder. LV will increase your HP as if it goes up. If your LV is high enough, you'll gain more XP, making it easier to manipulate people. 
I didn't know I was gonna be a toxic boyfriend, okay. Ask a question. Atrian SP. Atrian SP, also known as heart points and spoon points, are your personal stats. HP represents how much damage your soul can take before it breaks. When it reaches zero, you'll be so heartbroken that you won't be able to go on, so be careful. Uh, me, me, very, uh, very often. This is me very often. SP is primarily used to restore the broken souls of monsters. The monster's soul begins to crack. You make them swoon over your charming personality to bring them back. Oh, I do that every day. You get a very limited amount of SP, however, so use it wisely. Everything else I get. Alright, let's go do another puzzle. Human! There's one more puzzle left for you to test for me. This one is the most difficult one yet, so prepare your trembling bones! Oh, my trembling bones are prepared! Ooh! The Great Papyrus Junior Jumbo! I've always wanted to play the Junior Jumbo! I've always wanted to play- This is a dream come true! I've always wanted to play the Junior Jumbo! I love word games, like crosswords, word searches, Junior Jumbo! I'm so, I, I'm so excited! The most difficult kind of puzzle there is! Surely you won't be able to get past this! So long as I'm standing in front of you, you can't retreat. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, human, get your pens ready for the junior jumbo. I thought that said penis for a second. You tell Papyrus that you don't have any pens on you. Well, that is a bit of a conundrum. Do not worry, human. I came prepared for a situation like this. Ta-da! Papyrus pulls out a red pen from who knows what. Oh, I know where. So, just tell me what you think the answer is. I'll write it down if you're correct. And though I don't doubt your skills, if you need a hint, I will give you one. It's spaghetti! <laughs> Wait, that's how you saw spaghetti, right? Wowee! You solved it! Oh, you look so happy! And without a single hint either! I knew you could do it! should have known. Anyone human or monster knows spaghetti when they see it. I know spaghetti when I see it. It is only the greatest meal of all. I should know, for I am also great. I'll write down what you said now. There we go. On to the next one. Bone. Bone. <laughs> it's bones. Wowee! You saw the second one too. And still no hints. But maybe it was too obvious. After all, someone made of bones is standing right in front of you. Yeah. However, this becomes more difficult from here on, human. I'll write down what you said now. Oh, his handwriting! I didn't notice it! Oh, I love his handwriting! There we go! On to the next one! Sorry, I was looking at... The next one. Is it cool skeleton? C O O L S K E L E T O N95. It's it's cool skeleton 95. Wowie! You're really good at Junior Jumble, human! It's still without a single I follow Papyrus's, I don't know, OnlyFans. Not OnlyFans, not OnlyFans. No, I meant Instagram. I, I follow him on Instagram and Snapchat. Do you perhaps follow my post on the internet? Wait, do humans have internet? No, you must have just figured it out because you're that good at puzzles. Alright, done what you said now. It's all jumbled at the end because he started writing big. Okay. On to the next one. This one, I don't know. Great. It's great. I'm so stupid. It's great. Wowee! Another 
correct answer. And still no hints. Are you a puzzle master? A great answer, is it not? Almost as great as me. Yeah. I'll write down what you said now. There we go. On to the next one. Medicine. How do you spell it? Meta time. I feel like it's time. Okay. Clearly. Meta time. Okay, how do you spell meta time? Hold on. Because I know it's meta time. My, my, my typing skills are just not it right now. Meta. Meta time. I swear to god. Meta. Meta time. Is it not Metaton? Am I tripping? M E T T A T O N. Oh my god, is that not how I spelled it the first time? Whatever. Wowee! Another correct answer! Do you also know Metaton? I am, without a doubt, his greatest and number one fan. Oh, I know. Next time your show is on, we should watch it together. Oh, yes, we should. Well, wait, no, we can't. I forgot. I can't be friends with you. Forget what I said just now, human. I'll write down what you said now. That? You're incredible, human. I've never finished a junior jumble myself. They're the most challenging puzzles I've ever seen. But you? You completed it so quickly, and without any hints! That- I've- I've always been dying to do the Junior Jumble Man. This is- this is just what I do. It's just what I do. Wait, that means- Oh no! You completed all of my puzzles! Yeah! This isn't over yet, human! I will capture you! Later! He was just like later hater and he strut away with his batty hips. Okay. Alright, let's go into town. Yo! It's so cute! It seems you've approached a town. The cloth sign to your left reads, Welcome to Snowden Town. Your phone beeped with a notification. <laughs> oh my god, text from Bay! Hey, so you arrived in Snowden Town? Yeah, I have. What was that? Okay. Cool. Anyway, my boss said that he got through his puzzle super easily. He's still pretty set on capturing you, it seems. I wouldn't worry too much about it if I were you. But he may try to fight you. It just adds up from past experience. Thanks. No problem. Anyway, I'm gonna go back to work now. Or not. It depends on if the virus is watching or not. Either way, I'll be super busy. You figure you're not going to receive any more texts for a while. You put your phone away. <gasps> Hi, miss! Okay. Monster kid, the library bee, the igloo grill bees. Okay. Been streaming for an hour. We're already in Snowden. I'm gonna go ahead and save, and we're gonna end the stream for here for today. You're overwhelmed by the cuteness of the rabbit-like cinnamon model. You're filled with passion. Heart points and swim points restored. Yes. I don't- I, I don't know if that makes a difference. This game is like... It's very different than the other Undertale dating simulator I played. Which is odd because... For some reason I thought they were gonna be very similar. But they're not. This one is making me more anxious. Because it's not just Sans, it's everyone you gotta worry about. And it's- you can break their hearts. It feels like there's not just one possible ending. I mean, there were- there were three possible endings in the other one, but, you know. But again, thank you for coming to the stream. Hope you have a good day, night, afternoon, evening, whatever it is. Bye!